I got a story for you. Uh, the case of the reversible cabinet. Ooh, I know it's it's strange. Hmm. I go downstairs, you know, from my rented room uh, into the kitchen area. I look in my cabinet and everything's strange. It's like stuff is ass backwards. And I'm like, what the fuck? Who's been in my cabinet, you know? My silverware's down the other side and that's more awkward to get to. My cans are really older in the back of the peanut butter. It's like, what the fuck? This stuff was up front, you know? It says, who's been in here? My name tag's missing off the door. I had no idea that time the cabinet was reversible, that somebody put it back the wrong way. I had no idea, because there's still a drawer on the side of the cupboard door where it was. I didn't notice that it opened the other way, but yeah. <laughs> so I missed some obvious signs. Mm, not so bright, I guess, but anyway. Okay, Kevin, I said, Kevin in the kitchen. So it's like, I think it's Kevin, you know. <laughs> so what are you doing, man? Changing stuff in the cupboards now, you know? And he was all clued out about this. And then he says, well, <clears throat> better look for another explanation, because he knew it wasn't him, but I didn't know that yet. And then he talks about this rag, a bunch of rags he had under the window so that they look different from the way he actually puts them. So, then we're starting to put the clues together. Somebody came through the window and pushed the cabinet out of the way and put it back in the reverse position because it's a reversible cabinet. But I didn't know about the reversible part later on. <laughs> so, hmm, it wasn't Kevin. It was Thomas. Thomas lost his key and came in through the window. Later, Kevin found his key. So that explains everything for sure. <laughs> And he put it on the, the footsteps. When the owner's son came over and found the key and gave it to Kevin and he, uh, Thomas later. So, uh, strange to our reversible cabinet. Who fucking knew? You know, so it was, it was just put back the way now. But it appeared normal to me. But my knee tag was missing. And then Kevin reverses it again later. So then I see my knee tag on the front door and I'm looking at it, you know, the cabinet's back to the way it was. <sighs> anyway, I don't remember now if my silverware was shoved way in the back because it was reversed again after I already adjusted it. So I guess I'll have to see the order of the canned stuff, I think. But yeah, the second bit of grocery, I spent 84 bucks in food, canned stuff and that, Brussels sprouts. I had half a tortilla pie and Brussels sprouts with butter uh, and uh, three peppercorn gravy. It was delicious. You're welcome, yeah. Not very good. Yeah, I don't know what else to talk about now. Except for the case of the reversible cabinet. Yeah. Poor Kevin and I see no more. Who are you? What are you? Becoming my wife now? Moving my shit around? <laughs> it wasn't even him. Anyway, that's the story. It's a bit funny. Uh, see you later. Uh, Toodaloo, kangaroo, and a wild crocodile. See you later. I'll get a chow now, brown cow, and in a balloon by boom. Bah. How do you turn this off? Uh,